Good evening, it's Brian at Fitzpatrick's Garage, Kildare Town, Dublin Road, Kildare, uh, www.hondacenter.ie. Um, Brian is my name. If there's any information that you'd like on this particular car, give me a call 045 531 So this is a 2010, uh, pretty rare actually in this country, a Cord Tourer. Um, so it's a 2.2 diesel, it's an ESGT model. I'll run through that uh, with you in a minute. Um, so a 2.2 diesel, um, the diesel engine that's found in um, all the Accords um, from kind of 2009 onwards, well late 2008 onwards. Um, so it's 150 horsepower, um, really, really, really reliable unit. Um, no timing belt or anything like that to worry about, so pretty easy for maintenance. Um, these ones then for the year of road tax, they're 390 euros. Um, so six forward gears, uh, realistic fuel consumption figures, somewhere in the region of about, uh, got a long run, probably 50 miles per gallon. Realistically speaking, I think combined about 45. That's what normal people get, so. Uh, for many of the cars we take in in a similar category, like A4s and things like that, and IS220 diesels uh, in Lexus, they all run at about 45 odd miles per gallon. They do quote higher, but that's realistically what people are getting. Um, the thing that's unusual on this one, I suppose, is yes, it is a tour model. Uh, the car originally came from the UK. It's got a full uh, Honda service history with it. Um, so um, uh, condition-wise, it's quite nice throughout. Um, down the two sides, good and straight. I need to get into our workshop. Tires are pretty good, but I must get into our workshop to have a look to see what it's like in terms of tires and brake pads. Just waiting for a spot to come uh, open, so, uh, but we will be servicing the car. We will be putting 12 months of uh, warranty on the car as well. Um, same thing, down the passenger side, good and straight and tidy. Um, so an ESGT model, uh, what's nice about them is they have the nice uh, Honda styling kit on the outside, which is just the, um, the big chrome grille actually looks really well in silver cars, I think, but uh, that's standard on the model. Though. But the um, body kit, front fog lights, 17 inch alloys, side skirt down the side. Um, and then the roof rail is okay because it's a tour model, tinted rear glass. Uh, small little black diffuser across the back bumper. Um, so um, just to have a look in the boot. Uh, so what we have is obviously tannoy cover on top. Um, the boot initially doesn't look that deep. Um, it's quite long, um, but it doesn't look that deep until we open up uh, the usual way Honda do things, uh, kind of nice and clever. Pull it back like that and there's a load of storage in under there. They don't come with a spare wheel, but they do come with uh, puncture repair uh, down along there. Um, and then similarly, uh, more storage. Uh, so pretty clever and then a power outlet and stuff like that as well. So um, it's not a totally conventional boot um, uh, design, but you'd actually get uh, quite a bit of stuff in there. Um, Tint rear glass is uh, useful, obviously, especially it's so warm at the moment, but um, it is quite useful and um, looks well, I think. It actually looks really well. Um, tie locks in the rear, um, rear electrics, um, three three point safety belts, three head restraints, half leather interior, um, kangaroo pocket on the passenger rear side. Condition is quite nice um, in terms of fabrics, seating, materials, roof liner. All that stuff, uh, really nice condition. Um, and then on the inside, um, let's have a look. Okay, so the air conditioner is blowing at the moment, so sorry if it's a bit noisy. So just if we want to fold in our wing mirrors, we use that, electrics for mirrors, electrics for windows. Um, just to turn off the alarm. Um, and then after that, just traction control. We have cruise control up here, so we can set that and then we can uh, set our speed, average things like left in the tank. Uh, Bluetooth up through here so we can use our mobile phone. Um, heat and controls then, so I've got a passenger side and driver side control down here and then everything is up through here in the center. Uh, radio and CD down through there. Um, but then we've also got 12 volt um, outlet in here. Um, sorry, 12 volt outlet, USB and auxiliary even, um, as well just for using uh, music devices, drinks holders in here. Um, six um, forward gear gearbox. And then just because the SGT um, the um, aluminium um, pedals um, and then down at night time there's ambient lighting as well which is red in colour. Um, let's just have a quick, so there's loads and loads of history with the car. It's NCD'd until 0216 and then, uh, so long test and then tons and tons of, um, so there's about 116 or so thousand miles in the car and all 
book stamped all the way through um, in Southampton and Portsmouth in Honda uh, and then the cars come into this country it's had one service and now we're going to service it again um, so um, as I was saying the car will be supplied with 12 months of warranty um, and 12 months of roadside assist um, and then we're going to service the car and it's not quite due but I think um, we'll put it through a workshop get it checked over and we'll do a service on it anyway so we'll be happy to stand over it uh, we can take trade-ins, we can do finance, uh, so it's a 2010 Accord um, ESGT Tour um, 2.2, so if you want to have a look at any information on it, um, www.hondacentre.ie. If you're using YouTube, you could just subscribe to the channel, that'll be good. Uh, if you'd like us on Facebook, that's really good as well, so I'll look for Honda Centre Kildare. Uh, if there's any information you want on the car, please do give me a call, Brian is my name, 045-531-000, and thanks for watching.